Okay, we're going to start right here. This is where we've been revisiting our work on scripted animated objects. And the orange balloons have scripts that are supposed to make them randomly bump around. And the red balloons are neutrally buoyant, and the blue balloons are supposed to be slightly buoyant and float. So occasionally the orange will bump into something and you'll see, um, you'll see them react. So we would continue to rate this as about a meh in terms of satisfaction. For example, we've discovered that these orange balloons get stuck in the walls, even though they're, you know, they're supposed to be bouncing off the walls, not getting stuck in the walls. Nevertheless, <laughs> also you hear that clunk sound. We could technically make it eh, so that it plays a musical note when it bounces. So there is a there is a way. I should write that down as an idea for next time. Make the 3D object play a note when it hits something. So there's a way to do that. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Motion, Part 1, Clearing the Decks. Yes, this is a brand new series. This is the inaugural episode. In today's episode, we uh, composed our new tagline. This series shares composing in music, motion, and cross-dimensional thinking. Uh, we added uh, playlists and recap highlights and stuff so that this will be the first video that goes there. We also spent some time double checking our pentatonic parallel scales checklist and confirmed that as of our most recent series, we have now composed new work in all eight scales for in last year and this year in the, in the series to date. And we've had five composing series to date so far that we were live streaming. As we said, we checked it on our scripted balloons. We began researching webcam anime filters and completed a bunch of housekeeping tasks. So our ideas for next time are to um, these three chord areas here still have extended chords that can be added to them. And then we could also add chords to the regular C minor major diatonic scale. And then we could begin composing in those sets of four scales as part of this series. We also have an idea to make a left to right visual plus aural animation. So, so have one of those, like we said, that balloon is bouncing left to right, or maybe one of our music animations is going from left to right. We could have the sound pan from left to right simultaneously in sync. So that concludes today's stream. Acknowledgements to Miss Cleo who stopped by, Blackstrish who stopped by. Again, good to see you again. Uh, tune in next time to see what happens. Do take care, do come back, and do keep on streaming.